defense entirely can secure entire game. To shield, Stone comes out onto Weiwei. Maybe they can turn it around. Shanji gets some damage and he survives as well. Zika answers it. And Aki, I think, might just be able to finish off the Cassante flash available for him. But Juo's moving. Well, he's definitely a lot of fun to watch for a spectator. Especially when Rookie's playing Ooh. it. And I'll tell you what's not fun to watch. It's watching your jungler get absolutely one shot by NIP. And if that ain't grubs, I don't know what is. Anytime soon. Hung. We'll try. Oh, and Shikala stole one grub. Hungo is down for his trouble as Scout now gets the combo going down on towards Fotic. Fotic falls as in goes Zika to try and find Aki as well. Aki walking away troll. One HP as Shanji left alone. As he will be whittled down by uh -huh. Rookie underneath the tower. Nobody falls in the end, but now the answer from NIP. Uh, from LNG, sorry, as an arrow lands in the death realm, goes straight on towards Weiwei. Shanji finds his opportunity, 1v3, but the arrow saves the day. Flash from Weiwei, pulled back in. Can he escape? The claw comes down, but Weiwei survives. A little bit questionable from Scout to no TP into this fight, but his team had it all along and nets them yet another tower. In to try and buy space and time. That's a great ulti on Takala. He's pulled into the death realm. Arcane Shift already used. Has to flash into the pit, but he's chased down. In the meantime, though, the rest of the fight Zika. going the way of LNG. Scout finds one as Dwarf tries to buy more time. Fotik pulled in by Hung, but Hung won't be long for the wall. But now will Fotik as he dies into the backside. Shanji trying to shred through the health bars. It's a 3v3 here. Weiwei gets a primal search to keep himself alive, but goes down in the end. And Zika in a 2v1. But that's a win for Zika as he's on the Sante scouting fate sealed was down way he's gonna finish off the job oh and that's a cast of curse and a half that's a shutdown into the pocket away way wow that was a good one munch well played uh three one and three now sorry guys for I found scout gets his ult dodged away from us hung engages on the three man squad and rookie's gone lng set it up beautifully multiple threats as zick is diving the back line looking for Fotik. he's got barrier but is it enough the answer is no shanji finds zika in the death realm revenge is all shanji can hope for zika dodging he's looks alive. for the claw but he gets a heal in the last second the primal surge keeps zika alive lng indomitable 5.5k damage coming out of this Cassante in a previous fight, an LNG. And a pop in a ward potentially for Aki to try and steal, but I don't think Aki will get anywhere near that pit. Maybe he will. He's gonna Hold try, on. he's gonna try. He gets into the base 2k on the Baron, but they just turn around onto Aki. Great play from NIP. Baron secured. West Scout just wailing on the health bar. Q3 comes in the 1v1 is won by Scout. And now the rest of the team picked apart. LNG by two and Zika is behind the tower. Voting will fall. LNG, they're massacring NIP. It's all live. I don't oh. know if they can defend. I don't think they can. Hung has been so on point with his hooks across this game as well. Absolutely phenomenal stuff. LNG are just going to end the game right here, right now. Five seconds until Aki comes up, but the Nexus will be focused. Rookie barely survives. Draw not so lucky. Nexus down. LNG. A third blade of the Ruin King. Then you can go side lane. Shanji could not stop. For Shanji. Let's see if this is enough of a curveball to throw LNG's oh, in, but sets up for Gala's ultimate, the Dawning Shadow. And I think it dawned on NIP that this was not the play. Fire versus tree, who do you think wins? And then the hook will be able to follow it up as well. Zika just melts Fotik here. And I mean, gifting a kill over to Rumble this early in the game. We absolutely love it for the side of LNG. That was a great flat, uh, great team. Time for Hong, and he's still alive with a snipe with a mystic no, shot. Dead. Turns it around. Rookie will go down. Scout has the W on him, but no follow up. It's one for one. Uh, Aki and Zwar just about got out with their life. There's no reinforcements coming, and Hung nowhere out of the play. Rookie gifted that kill as Fotik uh, went for a reset. That'll be Tower in the top side. Shanji walking away with his life here. LNG maybe want to try and continue pushing. They've got a real time rookie looking on the top side, but Aki's been caught. Went way too far forwards, and this will be a tier two in the mid lane if they're not careful. Fotik gets a true shot barrage. Oh, Zika, so close, but can't quite finish the kill. Way too far forwards here. The root will buy a second of time, but that's all it'll buy. Aki now just going to accept his fate. Zika grabs the kill as rookie did manage to escape with his life. But again, so many players just getting caught alone and being picked off by either team. We saw it with Hunt's the tower by Aki. Hunt will walk away with his life. 
bit of damage. Roots come across the team as well to try and disengage, but that equalizer is huge. And Aki falls. Shanji pulled from over the wall, knocked up, will be stunned. That's going to be another one. Scout grabs that kill. And NIP, they're just giving over freebies at this point. Oh, and this could be the Baron as well. Aki down for another 20 seconds, 35. But a TP. Rookie dives onto Gala, looks for a kill to start it all off, and he will find it. Got it. That's one reset. Spotic moves in as well. 4v2 now, but back onto the Baron they go, and that will be Baron taken by LNG. NIP, all they get is a trade of kills. That was very clean from LNG. They take the numbers advantage. Three versus five to their favor. Smite down oh, for NFP hunting. as well, and Rookie is praying. Rookie. And Scout gets a TP of his own it's as Rookie's the one to go down his head, and Aki's alone on the play. Scout still surviving. Scout still oh. surviving. LNG cannot be stopped. The damage out from this LNG comp is insane, and Redemption keeps them alive as well. Shanji trying to get some damage out. Fotic and Rookie both ready to fire on all cylinders, but LNG still five strong. That was your chance, and IP doesn't get any better like th Hunt than this. SCP. LNG just dives under the tower. Four members, the fifth one TPing in. Can an IP defend? I don't think so. That's the tower going down. Rookie low on HP and a pull in comes through. There's a death charge onto Photic as well. NIP scattered, but they can't even flee. Hung won't let them. Three in hips taken. LNG, the placement games, they, they didn't mean anything. They didn't mean squat. They made it into group ascend. And now that they're here, they are here to play. LNG. Dominant in game number one, dominant in game number two. Nexus, Bear, Rookie, and Aki desperately trying to defend, but there's nothing to be done. The Nexus will fall, and LNG start the group stage. What? And it makes sense. They were the guys that brought back the lane swaps. They stuck.